So hello everybody, my name is Jennifer Francis and I am the proud leader of the Genuine Gems Avon team. We are actually one of the fastest growing teams in the entire country and I am number one in the nation right now uh, for personal leader development, which means that I help my team members make more money with Avon. What I wanna talk to you all about today is my order from campaign three or campaign two and campaign three what's new my demo orders all my picks um, it just came in so I'm super excited to show you what came in with my order and how I intend to use it to promote my business and I hope that maybe you'll get some ideas or even give me some ideas drop them in the comments about how you intend to use these products to promote your business before we get started, make sure that you've clicked that subscribe button and hit the bell to get notified for new videos and new releases. Let me start off by telling you um, about the what's new. The what's new um, is all of the brand new products um, that are com coming out with Avon in the upcoming campaigns. And this is the first thing that I look at when I get my Avon order um, is the what's new because it tells me A, what is going to be coming out and B, and most importantly, there are certain products in here that I am guaranteed to earn a certain amount of money on no matter what my order size. So if you're in your kickstart period or even if you're out of your kickstart period and you're not President's Club, you know that you have to reach a certain order size level to get that 40% earnings. Otherwise your earnings level is um, 20 to 40%. If you're under $150, your earnings level is going to be 20% earnings. So um, when you look through your what's new brochures, you will see exclusive representative offers down here at the bottom and you will see certain products are available to you for 30% or 50% if you're President's Club. Normally, as a President's Club member, for me to get 50% earnings on a product, I have to sell $1,575 um, to get that 50%. But these products that are in the what's new at 50% or 30%, I don't have a minimum order size to get those earnings. So it's a way to put a little bit of extra cash into your pocket. Um, and it's a way to save a little bit of extra money if you're replacing some of those items in your own bathroom. So in the campaign three, what's new, which is what we're gonna primarily be talking about today because you can now order from this brochure, the campaign three, what's new, starting today. And I am so excited about some of these products that are in here. Um, namely the Send Roses palette. Um, I actually did a an eyeshadow tutorial on the Send Roses palette and I linked it in the comments um, below or above, depending if you're watching this on Facebook or YouTube, where you can see how I use this palette to create um, an, a rose gold, smoky, um, everyday eyeshadow look really for beginners. It only uses a couple shades, it's nothing crazy, um, it's nothing super difficult, and it's something that um, everybody can do, your customers, everything, everybody. So I am loving the shades in this palette. Um, it is exactly pretty much the same as one particular palette that I used to buy that was $55. This does not cost $55, which I am super excited about because even for my customers, it's not going to cost them $55. Um, it's only going to cost them $15. But guess what? I, out of the demo book, am only paying $9 for this palette that I used to buy for 55. I am super excited, let me tell you. And it's got a variety of different shades. It's got some, I don't know if you guys can see, it's got some matte shades here. Um, and then it's got a little bit of, of shimmery shades. And then these are pure glitter shades. And I really use, um, I really try to enhance the glitter shades um, because I'm loving that look that I'm seeing like all over Pinterest and social media right now with just these bold popped glitter shades. And to do that, I use my makeup setting spray. I spray it on my um, eyeshadow brush and it's gotta be kind of like a, like a, a harder bristle um, 
to do it, but I spray some right on my makeup brush and then I pop it in here and I use the shade and we'll just use this one right now. And then I pop it on my eyelid and it gives it more of, it gives the shade more of a real, sorry about that guys. It gives the shade more of a real sort of pop and um, more of a metallic sort of finish. So I hope you can kind of see that a little bit. But I'm loving the lineup of shades in the Send Roses palette. Um, I can't get enough of it. Um, so definitely a must have for me. And right along with the Send Roses palette is the Blushed In Love Highlighter palette. Now I've been using this as kind of a contour and I'll do it right now so that you can kind of see how it goes on. Um, but I just use a fan brush and I just kind of try to find my cheekbone and go along uh, my cheekbone with a fan brush kind of to create a contoured look, um, slimming out and chiseling out my face. Isn't that pretty? So super pretty. And I love the shade. It's like perfect for my skin tone. Um, it's got kind of an iridescent feel to it, but it's not too shimmery that it looks, um, I don't know, weird. So um, that's the contour of that. And then it's got a blush as well, which is a super pretty coral shade that really goes perfectly with the Send Roses palette. And I just pop that onto my cheekbones right there and then just kind of blend it out to make sure that everything um, doesn't look like it has a lot of harsh lines going on. Um, so to go along with that, I've got the Get Me Glowing Rose Gold uh, Dazzle Drops. Now, I loved the Dazzle Drops that we had before, but I can't get enough that these are rose gold. I cannot tell you how excited I am that these are rose gold. Um, so I'm going to try them for the first time here. I've been playing with the Send Me Roses palette and the Blushed in Love palette here for a little while. Um, but this just came today and I am so super excited to try it. So I'm going to put a little bit on my hand so we can all see together. Let me turn my lights down a little bit. There we go. Oh, that's going to be pretty, you guys. So I just put a little bit on my hand and it's got really a pink iridescent um, look to it. I don't know if you can see because of the lights, um, but I'm just going to put a little bit on my finger and then I'm just going to dot it where I would normally use highlighter. And I feel like a little bit on this is going to go a really long way, but I love for my undertones that it has the pink iridescent feel to it. Um, I, I'm, I would totally try to use this on my eyes, um, maybe like right here in the corners, um, but also just like as an eyeshadow, but look at that glow. Can you guys see it? So pretty. And of course, I'm just doing this super fast um, with you guys here. Um, but like, I, I can't get enough. I love it. Hope you guys do too. So I just am going to wipe it off with one of my Rice Water Bright um, cleansing wipes. Love them. Super moisturizing. Love, love, love. So that was the Get Me Glowing dazzle drops um so like so many things that i'm so super excited about uh for the campaign three what's new okay so i know for a fact that a lot of you have been asking where you can get the lipstick bullets because um there hasn't been a, a huge variety of samples um, available to you. And we um, kind of have had to be creative about how we're gonna sample things to our customers. Um, one of the ways that we're being creative is just by saving money ourselves, which is great business, right? Like we're taking full size products and um, putting them into individualized containers or just taking them along with us as we're going about our day-to-day -day business and letting the customers sample them right there on the spot, right? That's saving money. It doesn't cost as much as buying like a small pack of five samples. I think it's super, super smart. But those of you that have wanted the lipstick bullets, I have an exciting announcement. Take a look at this. This is a tin 
and it's shaped like lips as you can see but look at the lipstick bullets that are in here and look at the cost savings that you're gonna get on all of these lipstick bullets let me look in the what's new really quickly and tell you exactly the cost on that tin so you're gonna get this for eight dollars which is basically around the same cost that you would have paid for your lipstick bullets before but this has 50 lipstick bullets in um, different shades within it it comes in it has a collection of 50 true color nourishing lipsticks um, some of the shades included are delicate date raspberry rose black cherry toasted cashew dragon fruit blush brown sugar mellow melon spring lilac that's one of my favorites peony blush that's my best seller and candy red so you've got 50 lipstick bullets in here that you can keep for yourself maybe you could do a demo of all of the different color of lipsticks on you maybe you could do a demo on your own arm um, or maybe you can hand them out to your best cu customers or maybe you keep it for yourself to have a lipstick of one of every shade to go with one of every um one of every um lipstick look so anyway um the demo price on that is 18 dollars not eight dollars like i had originally said looked at it wrong sorry guys um and then let's look and see what else we have so i got listen when i plan my demo orders i have to set a budget and the way that i do it is i take a certain percentage of my sales from the last campaign to determine what i'm going to spend on demos because you have to report your um, earnings to the tax man, right? Um, so I like to reinvest in my business um, to get tax write-offs in the future. So I reinvest in demos in my business, a certain percentage of my sales from last campaign, um, make a budget and then stick to that budget on demos. So anyway, I tell you that to tell you that last campaign, the Rouge Satin Moisture Lipstick was out of my budget. So I got it this campaign because I really hustled hard last campaign and I had a little bit extra um, available to spend. So I was super excited to try this. I heard it has a satin-like finish. Um, I'm not gonna put it on because I wanna put something else on, but I think I'm gonna really like that raspberry pink color. I think it's gonna look awesome with everything else from the Send Roses and the Be Blushed line of palettes. So I'm really, really, liking that um this is um in here one of our brand new lip products that is in a super super fun packaging but look look how fun the packaging is on this um and how how cute is this anyway like does anybody have um a college age person that they have in mind um for christmas this would be like the perfect gift for them and you could get them to try it and uh, show it off. So once we get it out of the packaging here, we'll show it. So anyway, this is what they call a lip tint. So not a lipstick, it's a lip tint, which means it's actually going to tint your lips. Um, so it is gonna have like um, maybe a semi-permanent kind of finish. Um, don't worry, it's gonna come off with a makeup remover and I'll show you that here um, as well. But um, it is going to to be something that stays on your lips for a while. So I got the raspberry limoncello. So let's see how that looks on my lips here. Oh, I'm liking it. And it's got sort of, oh, it's very like a glossy sort of feel to it. It's very smooth. Um, and it feels very moisturizing on my lips, which I really, really like. But how fun is that little container? So super cute, right? So definitely um, bright, bold colors in these um, lip products. Let me grab my rice water break and we'll take it off and see how hard it is to take off. See now, and it just wipes right off with a makeup remover wipe. Or I'm sure in the shower as well, but it's something... This is my first time trying it, but I've heard that they're going to last you most of the day, which is what most women want when they're looking at a lipstick. So 
Let's try my satin one on. Oh, I'm liking that color too, guys. And what I might do with this is I might actually, because this has more of a glossy finish, put this over top of the satin one just for fun, just to kind of gloss it up. Actually, I will tell you that while this feels glossy, um, I thought it was going to be a glossy lipstick because it feels like a lip gloss. It's just that moisturizing. But when I'm looking in the mirror at myself, it's a matte finish. This is, this is a matte finish, um, even though it feels glossy, which is like the best of both worlds, right? So let's see what other fun stuff we have from the C3 What's New. Let's, we have fun, lots of such beautiful jewelry um, coming out for Valentine's Day. It's for Valentine's Day, but um, it's something that you can really wear all year round. I think this necklace is going to be so super cute. Um, and again, had to set a budget, so couldn't get it all, but there are super cute um, products in there. There's a pair of earrings that have a heart on it that's for my list for next campaign. But how pretty is this necklace? It totally is going to make a statement, and I'm wearing it here with a gray turtleneck. I think this would also look great with a, um, with a black turtleneck, um, just kind of hanging down like that really really like that and really like how it is bold and makes a statement and then um cute little watch let me tell you something about our watches um our watches always 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 sell out and they sell out fast so um when you see a watch on sale you are going to sell it whether you're going to sell it to your customer who wants it um, at the last minute, or you can sell, or you'll be selling it to another Avon representative that didn't order it in early. So, this is one of my picks of things that are going to sell out. So there really is no harm in investing, um, especially in products that you know are going to sell out because you know that other Avon reps are going to be looking for them. So you're going to at least get your money back on them, while at the same time. Um, hitting those award sales goals that you're trying to hit to increase your earnings on the other sales that you have um, during the rest of the campaign. So that might be a good one um, for you to invest in. And then I decided to try one of the brand new hand soaps, which I got the lemon uh, sea salt and Amalfi lemon which it does, it has a lemony scent, but it's not a super strong lemony scent. Um, the bottle on this is absolutely huge. And this just, I mean, this easily will last in our house for a few months. Um, I mean, it, the bottle on it is, is really huge. But it reminds me of like Italy um, or like that Tuscan sort of feel and that Tuscan sort of decor, which I love. If you've ever been to my house, it's um, my husband always is like, does it have to look like the Olive Garden in here all the time? And I'm like, well, yes, yes, it does. Um, so this just really goes in with um, the whole theme all throughout my house. So I love that too. Um, and then of course I ran out of my Chi Replenishing Serum, so I had to stock up on that. And if you haven't tried our Chi products, you need to try those like yesterday. Let me tell you, I was a hair care snob. And when I ran out of my own shampoo, I was like, okay, instead of buying this expensive shampoo, I'm gonna try the Chi shampoo and see what I think. And I actually saved a ton of money and I like it better, especially this repairing serum, which isn't the shampoo. Um, I use it after the shampoo and the conditioner, but it makes my hair super soft. Um, gives me added volume and just like a silky smooth texture to my hair. But the whole Chi line of products, when you're ready and run out of your hair care products, definitely go and buy from yourself at a discount. Don't you dare go to Walmart and give that big business some money when you could be investing in your own business 
um, learning about the products that we have, all while saving money because you're buying from yourself at a discount. So yeah, that's why I got the chi. That's my, that, the short story on that is I ran on a chi and so I bought some. Um, so that is my major picks for the campaign three, what's new demo. Um, we can also still order from the campaign two, what's new demo. And what I think that I am most excited about that is the fashion. I actually am wearing one of the shirts here today um, from the fashion line from C2. Listen, our fashion is so popular and it sells out every time it is in the brochure, you guys. Um, it is limited edition, so your customers will likely be the only person in the room wearing Avon fashion because not just anybody can get their hands on it since it is limited edition. Um, but it's, it's so comfortable. It's, it's my personal style. Like I love comfortable cotton, soft basics that I can really dress up with bold jewelry and statement jewelry, um, and just kind of create whatever look, look that I'm looking for that day. Um, Emily and I did a fashion show for you guys showcasing the fashion that's coming out. I linked the, the video in the comments, either above if you're on Facebook or below if you're on YouTube. Um, I linked the video for you so that um, you could see the fashion on real people because the thing with Avon's fashion and Avon's jewelry is it's so much prettier in person than it is in the book. You really have to get it in to see it and experience it and it looks so much different on real people than it does on those models in the book and it makes a huge difference to your customers when you are wearing it and you can say hey this is Avon. When's the last time you've seen a brochure? Makes it super easy and a super comfortable way to bring your business into a conversation that you're already having, right? So that's number one. Number two, I had been waiting for Avon to get something like these monopop eyeshadow palettes. Like I am a total eyeshadow palette junkie. These remind me of another expensive palette that I used to buy um, and spend too much money on. Um, these are a fraction of the price for my customers and even less for me to buy from myself at a discount. You will never see me shopping at Walmart, uh, shopping at Target, shopping at Walgreens, or shopping at Sephora for my makeup anymore because I can buy it from myself at a discount um, and save myself a little bit of money and make myself a little bit of money too if I decide to share what I like with my friends. So these are the Monopop eyeshadow palettes. This is the Coral. It has a variety of shades in it. There is um, shimmer shades, um, sparkle shades, glimmer, sh gl glittery shades, matte shades. There literally is a shade for every type of look that you are trying to create. And what would it look like if you did a short video, maybe you went live on your Facebook page and went outside of your comfort zone and did a video of you using these eyeshadow palettes, or maybe you use the Send Roses palette. Um, and just do your makeup and talk to your followers and followers and your friends and your customers and just and just talk to them have a conversation it doesn't always have to be sell 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 all the time you can get on um, and talk about Christmas coming up or what you were doing that day while you do your makeup and then people are going to ask you what you're using and then that's when you can naturally bring your business into the conversation if you're afraid to do it um, live on facebook first of all don't be but if you can't get over that just record yourself on your phone doing your makeup and then post it on your facebook page um, you're going to get a lot of people asking you what you're using and how you're doing that um, people love to watch makeup tutorials like i sit around at night instead of watching tv like i watch these people do their makeup and then I try to copy it and like I try to learn like that is like a hot trend of things to watch on social media and YouTube and Pinterest and everywhere like I stop anytime I see a video of somebody doing their makeup because I want to see the transformation 
Have you ever um, watched like one of those shows like where they're redoing a house, let's say, and it looks like all in shambles um, and you just can't stop watching it. It doesn't matter if you have like a million things to do like and you're mad when the commercial is starting before they show you the finished product, right? You're like, you're mad. You're like, I want to see it. Like you're going to stay tuned into that because you want to see what the after looks like. It's no different with um, your customers, your followers, your friends. Um, and the people that you are interacting with on social media, they want to see that finished product too. So they're going to stick around and watch it, watch it and they're going to ask you. And it, it's really a good way to introduce your business to people. So I have linked in the comment section above or below some different videos and um, blog posts that go along with this, um, including my cushion foundation tutorial, uh, the mono pop eyeshadow tutorial, the Send Roses and Blushed in Love tutorial, and my picks for Campaign 2 and Campaign 3, what's new, what I would be looking at, what I would be investing in at, as, as demos. Um, again, I set a budget depending on my, my sales last campaign um, and plan to reinvest in my business at least a small amount the next campaign. Um, I choose to order more demos than I do brochures um, because I feel that my customers and um, my followers want to see the products. They want to see me using the products um, and I feel like I can really show them how to do that myself whereas the brochure, they may or may not look at it, they might get busy, but they might be watching me on social media, or um, I might be showing them and carrying it with me out and about. I do invest in brochures, but I invest in demos too. Um, just how I do things, that's not how you have to do things. You have to do what makes you successful in your business. Um, but it's just something to think about in, in when you decide what you're going to invest in, how much you're going to invest and what you're going to choose. Um, so these were my ideas and I hope uh, you got some ideas and I can't wait to see what you come up with when you, um, when you post a look, uh, when you put, post something, I would love for you to come back to the group or come back to the comments and post it um, and show us what you did. Um, it was so great to talk with all of you today and see all of my genuine gems and all of Avon Nation if you're on my YouTube channel. Um, happy selling, Merry Christmas, and goodbye everybody.